wanna rock! Welcome back to I wanna rock! Welcome back to Mutton Chop Play Along. I'm the Mutton Chop Gamer, and this is And I'm Twisted Sister. Are you just gonna come up with a new name every time you play? Probably. And we're about to take on Brock. We did a ton of level grinding while you guys were uh, gone, so let's take a look at our team as they stand right now. We have Landon, the level 11 uh, manky. Why did Invested I. Invested with lice. Birdo, the level 11 Pidgey. Who's gender confused? The Dew, the level 11 Ratata. More oh, like the Doofus. Yeah, the Doofus. Liglish, the level 11 Beedrill. The soon to be replaced HM slave. It's true. And bad. The ugly one! I'm not even gonna give him an introduction. I, I'm gonna try to keep him, because you know, water types are generally useful. Yeah, but there is a, water type is also the most abundant of the types. True. Ooh, I'm gonna go ahead and switch Pokemon going right in. Because I know that the first guy doesn't actually use rock type. What does he use? Ground type. Oh yeah, that's right. Yeah, he's a poser. Hi, you wanna dream big? Do you dare dreaming the Pokemon Champ? I'm no trainer, but I can advise you on how to win. Let me take you to the top. No. It's a free service, let's get it happening. But we said no! The first Pokemon out of the match is the left of the Pokemon list. Yes, I we know. Love this. By changing the order of Pokemon, you may gain an advantage. An advantage rewards man. Try different orders to suit your opponent's party. Wait. Chase! Get away from me, picnicker! 10,000 light Excuse years. me, sir. Would you like help crossing the street? Can I help you find a snipe? You don't want to get sued by Disney. Not Mr. Fredrickson Shops. And now we're going to use Bubble on this Geodude. <laughs> Just going to go right past that. Geodude must have one of the worst lives as Pokemon. Yeah, he, think about it. He keeps skipping leg day. He doesn't have legs. Oh, racist. But no, if you remember in either the Pokemon card entry or the Pokemon deck. Yeah. It says that people constantly trip over him. What makes you think he has a miserable life because of that? Maybe he's just an enormous troll. <laughs> hey, Frank, look, this guy's coming up. Watch this, watch this. What? <laughs> you just fell down a mountain. <laughs> Yeah, but what's gonna happen when the Pokemon animal control people come by? You don't have enough badges to train me. They don't have to train them. Ever heard of this thing called euthanization? That got dark really fast. Yeah. Hey, is Steel good against Rock type? Yep. Yeah. Oh yeah, then euthanization would work on it. Yes, it. And Dark type is neutral against it, so. Mm -hmm. And bubbly bubble. Aw, oh, Sandro, I love this little dude. Anyway. You killed him! Yep. Little dude, no! Little Green! Why? Because my name is Sandro. Someone hasn't been watching DBZ Abridged. No, I've been watching it, but how the hell do you link that to Sandro? You said kill the little dude. Moving on! Landon. You. Landon, you want to rock? Oh, by the way, I actually spoke to Landon today, and he absolutely loves the fact that we named this Mankey after him. It's the only Pokemon that really matters to me. Mm-hmm. One of these days, we just gotta get a side-by-side -side comparison of our friends with the Pokemon. Yeah. In fact, you know what? I'm gonna edit that in right here. Landon face and Mankey face. Oh, they both look adorably angry, don't they? Watch it be a picture of Landon in a Pinkie Pie shirt. <laughs> Adorable! <laughs> oh, <shit. laughs> Karate chop his face in! <laughs> Alright. 
Okay. So remember, use low kick on the onyx. Because it does damage based on weight, right? Right. And onyx is one of the heaviest Pokemon right now. Okay. So if Landon dies, I blame you. It's okay. I'll blame Kobe. Low kick. Okay, it missed. Okay. What's that shit? I think I might be able to survive one attack on his end. Okay. Yeah, see, that's good. You're good. Oh! I was actually kind of scared there. And Landon is now level 12. Oh yeah? Hand over your breeding kit, too. Come on, buddy. No more dreams for you. We don't get to breed until we get to the Sevy Islands. Oh, and because, uh, by the way, we're not going to quit halfway through like some other professional YouTuber that you may know. We're going to actually go through the Sevy Islands. Oh, shit. Are you really trying to lay a burn on another YouTuber? Maybe. That's like a level 2 Pidgey trying to take on a level 74 Vile Plume. Hey, I have the type advantage. Yes, but level <laughs> 2 versus level 72. Which one is going to get their soul absorbed? I like how you used Vile Plume in reference to the YouTuber that we're referencing here. Let's move on before this becomes a reference test. Okay, so we just beat Brock and we are about to start running. And run in, run in, and run in, run in. I thought you no, said we weren't going to have this. Rolling. I thought we weren't going to have this reference fest. It's not a reference, it's more singing. See? And besides, I'm not strolling. Look, look at this. <laughs> See, I'm flailing my way around. Oh man, imagine seeing someone walk like that in real life. <laughs> They'd just be going around, probably punch someone they accidentally walked oh. next to. Oh, it's a nerd. I'm going to try to avoid him. I got hit by a nerd! You can sense your Wii Avenue status. You stupid otaku. I'm not a taco. Then explain the spicy Tabasco sauce! I don't have no way to... Okay, so we just got the running shoes. And, uh, basically they're a gift from Mame. And we hold down the B button to run around. I'm faster than Sonic the Hedgehog! No, you're not. Yes, I am. No. Mario is faster than Sonic the Hedgehog. Yes, I will agree with that. Mario is, Mario is the best. Now, something we ought to try out, actually, hmm. is uh, basically body length, you know, basically going from front to back. We should experiment, then, see who is faster, red in the running shoes or Mario running. I think we both know who the real fast one is. Captain Flash. Planet, he's our hero. Gonna take pollution down to zero. I don't want to get hit by a copyright strike. Oh, come on. We both know Captain Planet's got the speed of trees. Trees are the fastest thing around. I'm pretty sure you're trolling, but I don't know for sure. Trees are fast. Have you seen them in the Looney Tunes cartoon? As soon as they fall, you're instantly squished. Not necessarily. Quick attack! Stop gusting my rat! Is it just me or does Rattata look a lot cuter from behind than in front? I mean, look at his little stance. He's got like a little... Are you saying thing. you think uh, Rattata's butt is cute? Yes, that's exactly what I'm saying. Okay, good. Look at him! Switch. Look at him! You see from the front, he's all... Nee, 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 nee. From the back, he looks like an adorable little Boston Bull Terrier. No, what the heck? We'll have a battle to the death. Birdo versus Pidgey. Dust. Right, this is intense. Who's gonna win? I have no idea. There's no possible inkling. Is oh, an inkling? Uh, a baby ink? You know? That's a good question. Dang it, I have to think I'm to think about that while I'm on <coughs> popcorn. popcorn chicken. I so, wonder if I can hear the crunching in the background. 
I have the most violent hiccups ever. Ever? <laughs> in fact, a lot of people think that when I have hiccups, I'm about to throw up. How many episodes are we in now? Three? Yep. And you're just getting the hiccups now. This is off to a great start. Watch me have hiccups every time we have an episode recording. Okay, I think it might be over now. You spoke too soon, my friend. That was fake when I was trying to put on the show for the audience. Did you just say they were fake? That one was. Oh. <laughs> Not all of my hiccups. Alright, so which Pokemon are we going to try and grind now? Well, I know that Misty, her Pokemon are like in the 20s or so. So I'm going to go ahead and switch out Badoop, because that's generally a safe one to have out in front. That's true. That's oh true. wait, this is a Bug Trainer. So the best one to put out against him would be Birdo. Oh yeah, that's true. You can tell because he's got the weird little hat. He saw me in Viridian Forest? Uh, what exactly did you see me doing in Viridian Forest? His bugs know what you did in the dark. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is why I am not a big fan of where our apartment is sitting. That was a loud, old... I think it was some kind of car. Maybe a motorcycle, I don't know. No, motorcycles are a lot louder. Yeah. Basically, everyone here in southern Utah decides that, hmm, we need to have the loudest cars as freaking possible. They gotta compensate for something. Gus! You know, I've always found it weird that Weedle has stickers on both ends. You don't? What? You don't have stingers on both ends? No. Oh. <clears throat> I've only got I'm not sure if I should censor that. Ah, dang it, Berta was poisoned. Yeah, you should probably censor that for the children. Yeah. Birdo! Alright, who's next? Another Caterpie. Alright, Caterpies are relatively easy, and since Birdo just leveled up, let's go ahead and send out Diglish. I mean, what's a Caterpie gonna do? String shot me? If this were a ROM hack, he'd be using Giga Impact on you. It's okay. I have Fury! And by the way, I don't, plan to, oh, I don't plan to keep this V-Drill too long. I really hope to get rid of him. Because let's face it, Beedrill isn't that good of a Pokemon. You think? Yeah, I do. That's why I just said it. Idiot. Idiot. That's not. <laughs> I'm gonna go drown my sorrows with fried chicken! Oh, I need to pay attention to the uh, number of things. Okay, can you get 21 more? Eh. One, two, three, four, four, five, six, four, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, actually do cool stuff. So I don't have them die by poison. And they can instead die by shame. What's so shameful about being trained by the bestest Pokemon trainer in the world? The fact that they're being trained by you instead. Sean? You're fired. But I don't even work here. Oh, would you like a job starting today? Boy, would I! You're fired! Why do I get the feeling that if I walk behind him... Okay, good, this isn't the place to be trap. Basically, one of these guys is a trap, where if you try to walk behind him, another guy will come up and trap you in. So you have to fight that first guy anyway. So you're bummed, either way. Pretty much. Alright, let's go, Bidoof. I like shorts! They're delightfully comfy and easy to wear!
Let's drown this mother. I'm still gonna have to censor that. Yeah. Oh, that was a powerful quick attack. Why is he faster than me? He could have a different nature. Okay, fine. I'll switch Pokemans to. Ah. What's up, guys? I'm a turtle! No, it's a squirrel. No, it's a squirrel. No, actually, I believe it's a tortoise. I am a Stegosaurus! <laughs> hey, fun fact, fun fact, Albert. I bet you didn't know. <laughs> this is gonna blow your mind. Okay, ready for this? Ready for this? You sure? Ready for this, Jelly? Ekans is snake spelled backwards. Holy crap! I know. Blew my mind. Blew my mind. Yeah, well, you want to know something about its evolution? Arbok? Yeah. It's Cobra backwards! What? Cobra Commanders in this game? Are you serious? Dang it, now I have to name Ekans Cobra Commander. <clears throat> or Cobra Kai. Yeah, that. Yeah, that works. Fury attack. Fury attack. It's a fury attack. YouTube comment section attack. Let's that would be a poison type move. move. No, it's more buck because it bugs the hell out of everyone. Now, if you want poison, we go to a 4chan message board. Okay, that's enough of that. I've been wrapped! Ekans has wrapped me! Ugh. Oh, that's a wrap, people. Next time on Let's Play! <laughs> Wait, did I minutes already? No, it hasn't. I was trying to throw you off. Now, since the Pokemon Center is free, I'm gonna go do that. Maybe we should edit out these walks back and forth between the Pokemon Center. Nah. If I have to suffer through it, so does the audience. <laughs> yeah, that's gonna mean we spend the rest of the game just doing this. Like the majority of our episodes is just going to be Oliver forgets where the nearest Pokemon Center is and walks all the way back to Pewter City to heal. <laughs> no. Once. Oh, that's going to happen once. I'm going. It's going to happen once. Watch me, I'm going to go out of my way to make sure that doesn't happen. Now that I've said it. Well, define going all the way back, like from where. How far would be all going all the way back? You know, would it be like if I get to Cerulean City and I have to go all the way back to Pewter? We're gonna edit in a montage song? No, we're not turning on any music. Well, I was going to say, like, we sing, you know, like, the yeah. corny voices with 80s rock in the background. See, this is actually a difference between the original Pokemon Red and Blue and Pokemon Fire and Leaf Green, because before, you couldn't see that lass. So you could only really see her once you got behind the bug trainer here, mm -hmm. and she would trap you in so you couldn't actually get around the bug trainer at all. Clever way of programming, if you ask me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, by the way. What? Weedle. God damn it. Well, what'd I do? It's Weedle, man. I don't know. Something about Weedle is just one of those Pokemon that I didn't really like as a kid. I can see that. That, uh, you saw my Weedle. We named it Licklace, remember? I know, but at the same time. You know, it took a long To censor that out too. You know that, right? It's totally worth it. <laughs> I hope so. You're the one editing this. I'm just here to provide stupid commentary. Well, at least you admit you're stupid. Yeah, well, stupid is stupid does, my friend. I'm confused. Exactly, stupid. You used to have root beer. You used to have fried chicken. Oh! So, you're allowed to reference Leroy Jenkins! Wait. No, oh, no, I wasn't trying to reference it, I was just saying I had fried chicken! I have fried chicken! If the camera was recording, I would show it to the camera and say, Look! Fried chicken! Not fried. Yes, it is! It's popcorn. It's still fried! Yeah, but it's not fried chicken. It's not from Kentucky, therefore it's not fried! 
Yes, but the fries are not from France, therefore they're not French fries. They're freedom fries. America. The music is like an evil screech right here. Or just like, get a braviary flying across the screen. Uh, future Oliver, could you do that? Edit in a braviary screaming at the top of its lungs and have it fly across the screen. Maybe throw in an American flag somewhere if you can. Uh, we'll do that next time on Mutton Shop Play Along. Oh, what? Okay. Bye-bye. We love you.